One of the most important techniques you can possibly know for this holiday season is the right way to open a bottle of bubbles. There's a couple of things to keep in mind. Number one, you don't need a wine key. The actual tab to open a bottle is already on the bottle itself. So all you have to do is find that tab and take the foil off. After that, things get a little bit trickier. First, you wanna undo the cage. And once you do that, the thing to remember is now this wine is your responsibility. Your thumb or your hand or something, you never wanna take it off of that cork. That's because the pressure in this bottle is the same as a fully pumped car tire. On top of that, you don't actually wanna take the cage off of the cork. The cage stays on the cork. All you need to do is pick up the wine and you turn the bottle, not the cork. So this hand stays still and this hand is doing the motion. So get a good grip and start to turn. And as you turn, you're gonna to start to feel that cork come. And as you do, give it a little bit of leverage with your hand so that it, when it comes out, it just gives a nice little sort of sound and not that big explosion. The reason you don't want that big explosion is a couple reasons. Number one, you don't wanna terrify somebody else in the room that maybe doesn't know you were about to do that. Number two, when you pop it, you might not know where the cork is gonna go. And number three, and this is the most important thing really, Think about the process of what it takes to make a really good bottle of bubbles. If you don't know, let me tell you, it's a minimum of three years. If we're talking champagne and almost that long for any other quality sparkling wine in the world. So if a producer spent three or more years trying to trap that sparkle in the bubble, and the first thing you do when you pull that cork out of the bottle is rip the CO2 out, which is what that explosion sound is, you're essentially making the wine go flat way faster than it would have if you just would have opened it the right way the first time.